do we think this is Tom's last game? No. Press conference sounded very uh, last game-ish, you know, thankful to a lot of people, happy, you know, kind of to – Well, I think – not happy, but I think he's genuinely, you know, yeah, saying how grateful and how much he respected his time there and all the people there. Yeah, I think that's fair. Uh, it, be, it was the last year on his contract there, right? Like he just did a one year contract. So like, uh, I don't I'm think it's his last game. Positive. It might be his last game in in Tampa. So you Tampa. think he's, he's still going to play potentially? Possibly, yeah. I think he's still going to play. Yeah, I'm never counting him out. He was especially number, with what's happened he was so number far. Three in yards. He's still dicing it up. I who knows? Who knows if he's done playing? Um, and you know, uh, I don't know if I want to list. I'm not a big betting lines guy. DraftKings, uh, but I am a DraftKings fan because they are supporters of the show. Yeah, where do you think he's going to end up next? Right now, they're saying Raiders and San Fran are in the lead. Uh, that is the DraftKings sportsbook uh, saying Raiders are. Uh, Plus, so that's where everybody thinks he's going. Do that's you think he's going Raiders he's or going. San Fran? I think San Fran's probably his best bet. The way that uh, Purdy is playing over there, he's pretty good. He uh, he's looking like he's going to be the starting quarterback for the Forty ers yeah. for for quite a while now. But obviously, you never know when uh, Tom Talk comes around. That'd be a crazy scenario. Yeah, 49ers Garoppolo, have a number Garoppolo of leaves New England to go start a new career, and then. Tom Brady comes in at the end of it. Yeah, Raiders obviously have McDaniels, so there's obviously some chemistry there. But I don't know if the Raiders are in a position right now that Tom's looking for. Yeah. Maybe they are. We know that um, we know that Patriots are not a chance because Gronk said it. And Gronk is Gronk Tom's did best say that. friend. Well, he didn't so. say it's definitely not happening, but he would be very surprised. I think we're Gronk's exact if he, was words. A bet- if he was a betting man, so he, scratch yeah. Patriots off He'd the scrap- list. Yeah. Yeah, I trust. Gronk's opinion. Uh, Dolphins, they got Dolphins, Tua. You got to think that he's going to come. Yeah. Tom's a I Florida do think, man now. I do think roster-wise, I don't know what's going to happen with Tua and all the concussions. I'm hoping and praying for the best for him. That'd be a great fit for Tom. I mean, you look at the weapons they got. The scheme. Um, the defense that they have was pretty, uh, pretty you know. Stout. Yeah, they got some good players on defense. Um, that'd be an intriguing fit. Uh Giants? I don't know, man. We didn't talk about that game much, but um, I guess Tom we're gonna going to get to it a little the bit. Giants just seems unethical, Daniel, man. I don't know. I guess they got to re-sign Daniel Jones, but Daniel Jones looked pretty good in that last game. Yeah, he did. Um, Jets. Again, I don't know if that's the right fit for him. Yeah, I doesn't seem like the right it. fit. I don't see it. I don't see we'll it. We'll see. Although there we was get, a there was a pretty good quarterback to war number twelve for him back in the day, of course. Joe Namath? Hey, this guy knows his football, man. I didn't know he wore number 12, to be honest with you. but I don't think he did. I just kind of pulled that out of my ass. He might. <laughs> it made, it, it connect, I connected it. I connected it. Oh, my gosh. And the survey says 12. He wore 12. Good job, <laughs> Trav. I'm a genius. He wore number 12, and he wore fur coats, baby. Let's keep it moving. 